They already know I bring that more than his flow. Although I'm hot as moon to lava off the Ivory Coast. Yeah, but I keep on telling you, son. If you don't like us, you better bring elephant guns. The new 4 liter engine. Okay, good morning everyone. Good morning. That good morning. was a really short night. We were editing it uh, until 3 o'clock in the morning <laughs> and we had to wake up at 5. But we are really excited to go back to Geneva. We got about 100 kilometers to go right now. Let's go check out day number 2. Two. Yeah. Woo! Woo. Rally roads. We've been stuck here for ages. The field press conference is already over, so I need to get in and make sure I can get the most of it. So bye bye. Bye bye. Finally, we got rid of him. Right. There's so much more rest in the car. Yeah, it's so peaceful now, isn't it? Yeah. We should do this more often. <laughs> yeah. I suggest we run. Yeah, run. Let's run. Are you out of breath already? No, of course not. We just started. I am. They already know I bring that more than this flow. Although I'm hot as smoke the lava off the Ivory Coast. Yeah, but I keep on telling you, son. If you don't like us, you better bring elephant guns. Intelligent fun. Ask him where the hell is he from. But I keep it home like a tent. I'm in the hell with it. Second to none. You know what? Once the sediment's done, I have them coming out of the shell like a pelican. Tongue. Tom, we're almost there, buddy. Yeah. Mediterranean chic, hot Arabian heat, tan Arabian skin, thick and crazy physique. All my ladies is hot, like we off at the beach. Hot as pepper and schnapps, soft as a peach. I'm a diva, but I'm hustling tree. Oh, honey, please, all you bees go and bust in the breeze. It's just me, I'm a queen, and a boss in the beat. But I'm a baby, so you never hear me cussing the streets. So I go, yeah, kicking on down the road, all alone. What do you guys think of the Aventador? Big improvement or not? Well, it's pretty much the same, but what's the difference? It's kind of similar. They did all the stuff with the bumpers. The sales are different. It's not more flowing line instead of the different details they had in carbon fiber. Okay. So, yeah, basically, this that is, it's, it's a small increase in horsepower, 20 horsepower more. Yeah. Uh, the interior is different because they now have like a bigger screen in the console, so that's an improvement. But all in all, it's like you know, it's a bit of a combination between the SP and standard Aventador. Yes, I don't see a big change. Um, no. I've always loved the Aventador. Anyhow, love to see it. Would never buy it. Oh yeah. Ruud, <laughs> moeten we nou Engels gaan praten? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, he yeah. does speak English. I do speak he, English. He just <laughs> acts like he doesn't. We all know this guy from. How do you spot? Good to see you, man. Yeah. Nice to meet you too again. Yeah. What kind of car do we have here? The Performante. Apparently, it went pretty quick on the Nordschleife. Apparently. Apparently. Why apparently? There are some question marks. I looked at a video two days ago. I don't know. It, I found it very clean. It might be true. It might not be true. The video would have been manipulated. Yeah, basically the story is because they put the proof online, everybody's analyzing it. And what they found out is probably fast forward a little bit. There are some glitches in it as well. So yeah, that's the downside of putting the proof online yourself then everybody can see and test it out if it's really true. I wouldn't wonder if the video would be manipulated because who am I? But I think it was too clean, you know, to go into Nordschleife, you need to drive a little bit dirty. You have to fight the car. And I didn't see that at all with this car. But it looks go a long way. Exactly. A targa car but i don't know it looks good i really good. love the mx5 in general always love them every yeah, you, generation you raced it? i also raced it yeah but i don't like the shape of this no it's a 
aggressive, it's, it's less of a hairdresser's car now. Well, the headlights okay, look good. That is true. Ferrari and all the other supercar brands learn from this. Look, you see that? Yeah. That's a manual. The wheel is kind of the same, but the rest is really different. It's a complete new dashboard. And the electrical seats are also going pretty fast back and forth. <laughs> Even that but, goes fast. Yeah, exactly. And what you see is closed properly? No, no, no. That's, that's a good thing. It's got soft closed doors. I was wondering, I closed the door. Perfect. Like, look at the A pillar. I want to. I, I like those details. Yeah. The the bare karma fiber, the glass in the door. Yeah. We got a Both. camera back here for uh, track use. <gasps> That's really good. You don't have to hang a GoPro anymore. Wait, let's see. I see the option of track telemetry. Driver name. Oh, all right. Wait. Okay. And now yep. I think it's time to start the car and <laughs> do some laps. Exactly, and yeah. turn off the traction control. But this car has the drift uh, modus, I guess, yeah. right? You can set an angle at mm -hmm. how far you can drift. Turbo, so at that angle, yeah. it stops, right? Yeah. Do I understand exactly. it well? Yeah. 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 I don't like the system because I think that it doesn't separate the boys from the men. So everybody can like sort of drift. Try to drift the uh, McLaren F1. Yeah, that's a different story. But okay, yeah, that's yeah. how the technology goes these days. But here it is. It's the called yeah. variable drift control. Exactly. And you press it. Set handling to sport. All right, let's do this. Set. And there goes the screen. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty nice. Huh. The McLaren bucket seats are like the are always very good. They're not soft. They're hard, and I like that. Like the well, the, you, you feel the car in your butt. But I have to say that I do feel more a sense of quality in here. It looks like the leather is higher quality, the stitching is, is better. I don't see a big difference with um, 675 LT. Mm, but it's, it, it, it feels more quality. Also this I really like, and the new buttons they got here. It used to be like the small fiddly buttons, now you got like proper proper buttons to do yeah. that. Yeah, let's check out the exterior. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Do you like it more than the 675 LT? I'm, I only mean the shape. Yeah, I do, I do. Okay. Because it's a new, completely new model. It's the same thing with you take a, a 458 Speciali or a 488. It is cleaner. It's cleaner and it's, it's more, more of age. It's a mature design instead of you know, a collection of, yeah. of lines. Do you think this car will be better on track than the 675 LT, or is I think it will. I yeah? think it will. It's got the new four-liter engine. Okay. The completely new engine for the first time in well, yeah. when they brought out the 12C. So this should be should be really well, really good. Okay, because the 675 LT it's already so so good. It is. So if this one should be better, and it should be, then I can't wait to drive it. Yeah. 